Hey, it's Jean back again with uh, the final room of my Valentine tour. This is my office, craft space, studio, whatever you want to call it. Uh, this is a cute little lavender heart wreath that came from Michael's this year. And of course, that's some of our toy collection right there. This little garland, red, pink, and white, came from Target. Uh, they're little paper tassels, and I just think they are absolutely adorable. And they just fit perfectly right there. This is some of my workspace right here. Another crown, of course, you all that have looked at a lot of my videos know that I love crowns. And there is a little pink heart from Michaels. Some of my Paris collection. There's my workstation. More of my workstation. There are some of my new Ray Dunn flower pots, and I'm using that set to keep some of my craft supplies. And in this two tier tray that I got at Michael's this year, I've got some of my um, ribbons and jute, and I have my Ray Dunn Create mug there with some more supplies in it. And back in the back, that is a little antique autograph book. And it's absolutely precious. My little porcelain doll collection. And I got a couple little Valentine hearts in there. Another old bingo card that I embellished. These are my P. Buckley moths and another vintage print right there. This is one of my little trees that I there again, do it, it for all the different seasons. I still have the red check ribbon on there that was on there for Christmas, but I added the little cute Scotty dogs. They actually have little Google eyes and then some little heart picks on the top. Here I have some of the little pink trim that I got at Target and have some of the little hearts that came from Michael's last year. I got them, I think it was 75% off in that cloche. Got some more little hearts stuck in my little vintage baby shoes. And this little heart lights came from TJ Maxx last year after Valentine's Day on sale. And some more hearts in my crown. And in the back there, those are actually little vintage uh, silver things that I got many years ago. They're little dust pans. They did them for different uh, cities and just much, many, many different styles. That one there in the back with the ladies, that's actually Art Deco. So that one is a super old one. And I collect old plates and cups and, of course, the toll trays. And up there is a red heart. And another red heart that I've had for several years. I don't even remember where that one came from. Another toll tray. Some hearts in the old flower frogs. That's another collection I have. Is I have a lot of different kinds of old flower frogs. 
and old postcards. More vintage baby shoes with some hearts in them. Some hearts laying on this tray with my cherub. And some different little sewing notions there. And old pins. Another crown. This is not Valentine, but this is something that stays in this room all the time. Some of my little children's irons and the little stove and some of the little tin canisters and dishes and little washboards and cleaning supplies. And this is a little old cupboard that we got at a church sale. Another one of my trees that stays out all the time. I love being able to use something for many times of the year rather than just one time. And I just added some hearts and there's some little mercury glass hearts on here too. Of course, along with some crowns. Another Valentine tree. I have some red tassels from Target on there and some hearts. And there actually are a few vintage decorations, these little angels with the tinsel. Those are actually meant to be used at Christmas, but I thought they were appropriate for Valentine's. And then there's some more of those little clothespins from Target. My Santa stays out all the time. And I collect hands, and I love hanging old jewelry on them. And this garland with the Scotties and the little hearts, that came from Michael's last year at 70% off. Another big toll tray. Love old jars, as you can tell. This heart up here is another heart that we got at Target unpainted. John painted it and then we embellished it with old keys and lock. Those old drawers could have been old watchmaker's drawers. They were some kind of tool drawers. I love them because it gives you a lot of space to store your craft supplies. And I just felt a cat rub my legs. That's probably baby boy. And that is my dog barking. There's an overview of the back of the room. Little child's cupboard. Baby boy. Baby boy. Baby boy. Baby boy. He's going to love everything, but he's not going to turn around so that you can see him this time. Well, thank you so much for watching. I hope to have another video for you another time. I'll be redoing some of my rooms all along, so you'll get to come along with the journey. And I'll definitely be doing Mundun Monday tomorrow with some of my Ray Dunn finds. Have a wonderful afternoon, and thanks again. Please subscribe if you haven't already.